First post, 3rd of August 2023, How China's Purging Playbook was inspired by a poorly written Russian horror fiction authored by Xi Jinping. Nikolai Chernyshevsky's book What is to be done? serves as a source of inspiration for Xi Jinping, who uses it to identify and neutralize any threats from essential allies, both military and civilian, to maintain his position as China's top power. With President Xi Jinping at the helm, China is going through another purge. This is demonstrated by the abrupt removal of two senior commanders of its prestigious rocket force unit, which oversees its nuclear weapons. The People's Liberation Army PLA, General Li Yuchao and his deputy had allegedly disappeared for several months. The Chinese Communist Party CCP, Central Committee member Xu Sheng and former Deputy Navy Head Wang Hubin are the new successors. This action is interpreted as Xi's attempt to tighten his hold on the PLA before this, Qin Gang, the Chinese foreign minister, vanished inexplicably. Wang Yi has taken his place. Since assuming power in 1949, the CCP has undergone numerous purges. Among the prominent figures who have fallen prey to the power struggle recently are Zhao Ziyang, the general secretary, and Hu Yaobang, the outgoing secretary. Purges have become a regular feature of the Chinese dictatorship, targeting several province heads, generals, and mayors of Beijing and Shanghai. Xi Jinping made sure his primary opponents were removed. Zhou Yang Kang and Bo Xilai are incarcerated. Members of the Politburo Sun Zhenkai and Ling Jiwa have also been attended to in the guise of an anti-corruption effort. A minimum of two generals from the Central Military Commission were abruptly dismissed, one passed away, and the other was detained on suspicion of corruption. She's models for the Chinese opposition clearance. He adheres to two different playbooks about the purging under Xi's administration. One of them is the history of the Communist Party of the Soviet Union. Bolsheviks, a book written by the notorious Soviet dictator Joseph Stalin that describes how to run a dictatorship. The other is the controversial utopian novel What is to be Done? by Russian author Nikolai Chernyshevsky. This book, which Stalin released in 1939 as a guide for a short course for communist cadres, significantly impacted the Chinese communist movement. It is possible to see the parallels between Stalin's manual, which detailed how he had destroyed his opponents within the Soviet Communist Party and the purge carried out by Xi Jinping in China. He candidly detailed his actions against his competitors in 1926-1929 in Chapter 10, the first five-year plan of socialist construction was adopted. Large-scale development was made by constructing new factories, state farms, and collective farms. Along with this move toward socialism, class conflict was hardened nationally and inside the party. The primary outcomes of this conflict were the crushing of the Kulak resistance, the exposure of the Trotskyite and Xenovivite capitulators as an anti-Soviet bloc, the exposure of the right capitulators as Kulak agents, the expulsion of the Trotskyites from the party, and the declaration that the beliefs of the Trotskyites and the right opportunists were incompatible with membership in the CPSU. B.